Next, we will be looking at exporting and importing stuff. Anything you create on Weavy, you can export easily by using this top right hand menu. Click and download the current generation or all of the generations. You can do the same by right clicking on the generated image and downloading all of them or just the current one you're looking at. Another option would be to add an export node. So anything you connect an export node to and click on export will be saved to your downloads folder. All right, so that's I think sums it up in terms of exporting. Let's look at importing. Some of the models can use reference image to generate. So let's see how you import a reference image. Right click would open this shortcut menu. Click on the import which opens the import node. Clicking on it will go directly to your library and you can choose whatever you want to import. Let's go for this Weavy logo. I'd connect it into the reference image input in the ideogram v2 ai model and run not sure what we're going to get but that's interesting how will ideogram will use our logo to manipulate the generation of this image okay wow this is super interesting i can of course change the reference image weight it means how much will the reference affect the generated image let's go for a lower one and examine some more ways we can import image so Going into my Google image search, I can always right click an image, copy it. So everything on the clipboard will be pasted pretty easily into Weavy for further use. This is also interesting, right? And another way would be just dragging and dropping images inside. So Weavy can accept in this way, either by the import node or by dragging and dropping, copy and pasting. We can accept images, videos, etc. So that was a short video for exporting and importing stuff to Weavy.